This is my old E36 328i genuine M Sport that you have um, just just ruined. <laughs> I, do, I do not want to see a V8 in that car, but. Yo, look where I'm at. We have come down a BQR. Uh, we're in Cheltenham. I'm here for the day. I want to see my old friends. So I'm going to still bock in a minute. We're going to look around some of their cars, see what they're up to, and check out his latest off-roader overland project thing. But the boys are here. So uh, before we go get some food, I really want to do a quick video with him, get back on the channel, have a bit of a laugh. And uh, yeah, it should be a good crack. So let's go see him. I've seen it. I've seen it. I've seen the one with you and Mark. That's just... Hello. <laughs> I'm talking about some real rude stuff here. Are you in it though? Bok. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Welcome back. Well, I should yeah. say welcome oh. to your unit. I've never oh, been I here know. before. I've never left. So uh, you've got you've got some carpentry skills on the go at the moment. Um, we'll get to that in a minute. Can we just have a look at the, the good cars? The dirtiest the unit's ever been, so you came at a good time. <laughs> Basically, I just wanted to show people what you were up to here because we haven't seen each other in ages and we used to do lots of stuff together on videos and now we never do that no, when we hang out. <laughs> That's not that. It ain't that. It ain't that. But let's start with this one, the drift car. We last saw you at Birmingham Wheels in this, right? Yeah. And you cracked a wheel. And then... Woo! <laughs> I guess that's a good way to introduce you today. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> These are my nice wheels as well. Good. That's funny yeah. for me, anyway. Lost the wheel. Yep. Oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who won up to each other on that one, but we both fucked it basically. So, how is this? Men. It really is. I love it. It's so fun to drive. I really, oh god, you've got an actual spider web there. I'm not going to put my name. But what's the plan? Are we going to get you drifting again at some point or? Yeah. Um, hydro, I'm going to paint it white. Are you? Yeah, I reckon. And then it's, it's literally done. Like, it doesn't need anything else. But I kind of just put that on hold for a bit. Yeah? Yeah. I'll wait until the um, trailer's sorted and then I can actually take a skid events. But we've got the new one as well. New. No wheels shut. Yeah. There's an, they've got a new one. So it's like kind of close to us. Oh, here. <laughs> the one I should never have sold. Uh, so this is my old E36 328i genuine M Sport that you have um, just, just ruined. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, at the moment, we're doing all the suspension. Yep. So everything's come off. It's gone to powder coaters. Uh, this all needs to be like reinforced, uncoated. Can't be fucked to do that job. That's yep. what's been here for like months. Yep. Uh, Four V8 down the ice. See, what's, what's the deal with this bocker? We've got to have a word, mate. That's a genuine 328 like, M Sport. You, the, I wanted to build an E36 V8, right? <clears throat> so I was going to buy another shell to to put it in, because I didn't want to ruin that. And then I was like, if I've got them next to each other, I'm never going to take 328 out. I'll always take the V8. So I was like, well, I'm just putting the V8 in that then. I, I have to that. just let, uh, so obviously you've, you, like, obviously like, Bocca bought this off me, like a the week, worst time. Like, a week before they become ultra valuable. Like I literally sold it and then everyone went, brilliant, they're worth nine grand now. And I, you definitely didn't pay nine grand. No. So uh, it's a great car, but the cool thing is, I'm going to fight your corner again, even though I do, I do not want to see a V8 in that car. But it's your car now, so you can do whatever you want with it. <laughs> and it's just there. But you do have the engine still in here. Yeah, it rips. So if you ever want to sell it as a 328 M Sport, yeah, you can just like change it back in and then it's back to being an original well, my thought was, valuable like, car. If I ever feel like that's not got enough power... And I'll just take the V8 and like, put it in that. I think give Spot it. I think out. I'm gonna drag you on some bigger drift days soon. Instead of just like little car park ones, you're you're good enough now to hit a proper big track. Then you're gonna want and you you're gonna want the V8. Yeah, it's definitely gonna happen. Um, but it's so good to see this again, man. Uh, if anybody is a fan of this, there's loads of videos on my channel of this car. I loved owning it. It was just a time in my life I had to I had to part with it for multiple reasons, really. And it's... at the same time, you wanted to buy one, so. The perfect collab happened, and uh, yeah, and I get to see it again, and it's still beautiful, and it's still one of my favourite cars. It's and the best looking car. Yeah. It... The seven. Yep. Um, What's the deal? Why did you buy it in the first place? Like, this is such a random machine. They're really cool. They are amazing. My dad had one when I was growing up, so I was like, ah, oh, be nice to have one. Hey, I did so, that with uh, the Honda Legend. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's what I did. Yeah, boy, I was like, this thing's sick, and then the Passat was broke, so I was like, oh, daily. I insured it and I insured it for a week and I spent like 
120 quid in fuel. <laughs> just driving to and from the gym. What engine's in this one? 4.4. Oh my goodness me. Is it open? No. Maybe? Yes, yeah. it is. I'm sorry. I just, I have to look at this because this is the, the coolest. Phone. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, it smells like an old BMW okay. as well. Oh, it's so good. How much do you want for it? Uh, I paid four, so I'd take four for it. Oh, it's a bit too expensive for me. Some machine. It's cool. Very cool, but it just has no place. So if anyone's got four grand and wants an absolute monster vehicle, yeah. there she is. Full cool service history. It's nice, man. It's actually, like, cool. Yeah, it's sick. Oh, that would be sweet. All right, let's leave this car before I buy it. <laughs> let's go to the old girl over here. What's going on with this, man? Uh, did a track day, cut the tyres, realised I need LSD, so I just can't be asked to spend three grand on tyres and LSD. But when I next book track day, I'll have to do it. Um, but this thing is just mint. It's so cool still. That's still probably, you know the video we did on this? Yeah, we'll go through it in a row. That was probably one of my favourite videos I've ever done because yeah. we had a cameraman for the day as well so we could just absolutely cock about and it was just hilarious and that video is going to be in whatever corner the link's in uh, for people to check out. The was sick was when I just came down you had the, the DC5 five, yeah. and we were just pissing around. And yeah, that. those days can still happen because most of my cars work now and I obviously also have this thing now. So, so yeah, I yeah, love it. Else. It's just, it doesn't really need much. Just an LSD and some tyres. And then you've got the best car in the world. This is this is just such a good car. We're on 208k now. Uh, and I just fixed it up a bunch. I just don't care about it. I do care about it a little bit, but like not yet. Anyway. But yeah, this is auto, heated seats. It's a two litre. You know we're old and we're getting excited about this. We spent more time talking about this than the other ones. I anyway, I want to talk about this beast, man. Because this is... This seems to be the thing that makes you the most happy that I've seen out of all of the vehicles. So... I need to know about this because I've obviously been watching the series on it, but now I'm here in front of it. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna see it a bit more, man, like, and understand what's it like owning this thing because this is like so different. Um, it's just unreal. It looks cool. So, I mean, it really does look cool. There's a lot of other better four wheel you can get that would do what I want to do better, like big trips and stuff. Um, but it's kind of like, yeah, I just kind of fell in love with them, so I bought one. And then I just loved it even more. And they're just mint, so really. good. I mean, it's so mint. What's that? Drive over shit. You can just go wherever you want. It looks so cool as well. It looks so, like, just aggressive. And yeah. Can I have a look inside? Yeah. I know the seats are falling forward. It's all being worked at the moment. It's a bit... Wow. It's so, like, military. It's proper basic. It's just so, like, such a weird car, yeah. considering your collection of what you've got. And you're like, no. I'm just going to go buy a Defender and go and drive through lakes. Do you know what? <laughs> what how it came about was, um, I was like, I want to do trips. And I want to go, like, places. And I was like, I actually hate people. Mm -hmm. Like, I like people. I hate, like, general public. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So with this, you can kind of get away from them, yeah. which is nice. And, and I was just, like, oh, I could yeah. do a van bill, but then you're going to be parked up with every other van. And I was like, whereas these, you can just kind of, like, get away. I love it, mate. I think it's so cool. But uh, it's been cool to see the unit, see my old BMW again, and see you. Cause it's been so fucking long. Man. It's been too long, man. So, uh, yeah, even though you weren't meant to come to Wales E-Fest, but what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we're gonna uh, we're just going to hang out and chill. I didn't want the cameras to be out much today. I'm filming on my phone, as always. We have a, a rule as well. Never can have two cameras out at the same time. No. It's, 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 it's not allowed to happen. It's not, it's not real. So, uh, yeah, just a quick video here, checking out his cars. We're going to go get some food, right, and just hang out. And then, uh, and then I've got to bounce. But, yeah, let's fucking chill, man. Nice to see you. Yeah, it's nice to see you, Jimmy. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> You're going cross eyed when you should be doing <laughs> You look like my mum. <laughs> oh, that's what will happen to that girl that passed off to Rob on the night out. So, uh, you can't come to your boy's f fucking clothing unit without buying a bit of merch, can you, mate? So, Bok has kind of let me try this on and I'm just going to take it. But, oh, yeah, sorry, Bok. Come on, mate. Come on, mate. Super, super nice, man. The thing is, yours isn't merch, is it? This is a clothing yeah, brand. Like, this is, a, this is a line of clothing. Are these your coats as well? No, nah, they're samples. Okay. They are mine, but they're samples. So, can people see the samples or is it like... Yeah, they're pretty basic. I just yeah. start, start with the base. Oh, hang on. Come on, though. This is what I would wear. Yeah. Yeah, what I look like. Do I look fancy? Let me zip it up. That does look good on you. Give us a spin. Oh, yeah, look at that. This red is super nice as well. 
I'm not gonna lie though, I was a bit torn because both of these colors are really nice as well. Cool workshop. Also, I bought the M3 out for this trip and it's been amazing to drive it. So I think I'm gonna have to get a little road trip sorted. Do you wanna go on a road trip at some point? Yeah. Sweet, done. Uh, where's my wallet? Going in Stu's Colorado three door. I love a Land Cruiser. Got my wallet, yeah. Sick. Factory lock in depth as well. Fucking big old stick. Pedo's wet dream this truck. We'll have that start this like. <laughs> I've that, he's just bowling that to me. I'll, I'll take it Doggy home. bag, take <laughs> home. <laughs> I, bet, I literally just saw it in so I forgot to show you because we're, we're tired now. We've eaten lots of food, right? <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> Should we show them what you're actually doing with your truck? So I didn't show them the inside. Oh, yeah. Truck. So you're like proper like overlander now, bae. Mm, yeah. Big bae. And this has got to be ready by when? I got one day. <laughs> well, good luck, mate. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to love you and leave you in a minute anyway. Yeah, so. I'm going to stay here all night. Come on, baby. Pop the lunch. See <laughs> so we're done we're gonna rendezvous again one day soon hopefully and do some stupid shit yeah we have to organize some stuff you can you can always come down whenever you guys want so you're 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 an overlander bay now but anyway that's bocker and that so bye <laughs> bye bye, bye.